the horned woman, the beast. Nothing could stop them. Not our steel, not our prayers. <sighs> Listen to me. I must find Donan. Where is he? Some... somewhere inside. Dead, like the rest, for all I know. The light has forsaken this place. ready yet. Light, cleanse these faithful servants of their sin. Bring them peace in death. Bloody miracle you made it here in one piece. Lilith and that beast tore right through us. Could have killed me too. 
but she left me untouched. She's toying with me. She wants me to watch her destroy everything I've built. Damn it! Did you see Yorin the way you came? No. She hasn't won yet. There's still a chance to stop her. But I can't do it alone. I'm with you. Where is she now? An old chamber beneath the keep. That's where Astaroth is. I didn't vanquish him like the stories say. I imprisoned him in a soul stone. It was a last resort. I built Eldheim over the stone to contain its evil. I spent my life watching over it, keeping it a secret, so Astaroth would never hurt anyone again. Not even my son knows. I'm sorry for hiding this from you before, but I couldn't risk a stranger finding out the truth. We should get moving. Follow me. If you didn't see Yorin outside, we'll search on the way. When was the last time you saw Yorin? We were discussing what happened to Erida, and then Lilith stormed the keep. I ordered some guards to escort him out of Eldheim. Stayed with him. I must wait. I'm not ready yet. One of Yarin's protectors. Quickly! Yorin's mace is here. I told them to get out! Maybe he and the knights tried to stop Lilith. Could she have taken him somewhere? What possible reason would she have? He means nothing to her. We need to move. The way to Astaroth is through here. myself that same question. I'm not as much in the dark about it as you are, I'm afraid. We share a connection, though, on a strong path. Astaroth is a guardian of Lilith's father, Mephisto, the Lord of Hatred. I must wait. <laughs> I must wait. Here it is. 
the Soul Stone Chamber. Lilith has what she wanted all this time. She took the stone. No sign of Yorin, though. We need to find him. Mighty Astaroth, the charred duke himself, confined to a cage. What a pity. Daughter of hatred. I have an offer. You will grant me safe passage to a place I am no longer welcome. In exchange, I will give you freedom. And more. <laughs> Donan's progeny. His pride and joy. Your retribution. If you give me what I want. <laughs> this all seems, but I've spent half my life studying the Soul Stone. I know its nature. It will take time for Astaroth to overpower my boy. I taught him well. Even now, he, he's resisting the demon's influence. It, they'll be close by. Karagar, perhaps. Yeah. All those innocents to burn will excite Astaroth, make him fight harder to, 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 to take control. Lilith has what she wanted from Astaroth. Why would she linger here? I... I don't know. I... I had to, so... I turned to the... None of that matters now. They did this to me, to my boy.
Shame about Yorin. Was one of us, you know. We'll take care of him and his father. Lilith and Astaroth had made a deal. And we were the ones who would pay the cost. Our presence was no coincidence. Everything happened exactly as Lilith wanted. We just danced to her music. Donan was shattered. His mind on grief, not her. Not answers. No one knew what Lilith was truly after, or exactly what Astaroth had promised her. But we needed to recover quickly, and we needed to stop chasing her phantoms. Just wait.
I'm not ready yet. Wait. ready yet. I'm not ready yet. I can't do that here. as they please. We must often remind them otherwise. Let's see what you can do. Clean kill! The Forge Master was right to send you. You might just survive. Survive what? Alright, stay your hand! Oh, the vermin have bled enough. There's a small cave nearby, where your final test awaits. These vermin imagine they can take our land as they please. We must often remind them otherwise. Well, let's see what you can do. These vermin imagine they can take our land as they please. We must often remind them otherwise. Let's see what you can do. Oh, 
can we never have peace? Mm, shouting and cursing all night. They shall run him out of town. No breathing. He is lucky to be. That old man there, he claims to be Horadrim, but he drinks like an ox. He came to town days ago, looking for a servant of the demon Lilith. A pale man. It seems he didn't like what he found. I see. I will take it from here. Who are you? He and I met in the Fractured Peaks. I saw his pale man in a vision, if you can believe it. Enough. He's yours. Just keep away from the bottle, both of you. What do you want? You told me to meet you here, Lorath. Remember? Of course I remember. I'm just surprised you're not dead. Hand me that bottle. What happened to you? I was attacked, obviously, by vast quantities of alcohol, wielded by my own treacherous hand. <sighs> There may also have been a brawl with the goats over this patch of mud. But I like to think I triumphed. Morath, who is the Pale Man? <sighs> the Pale Man is... was... Haradrim. Haradrim? Then you must know him. <sighs> I thought I did, once. His name is Elias. He was my apprentice. He was the one who brought Lilith to Sanctuary. It's possible that I did not take the news very well. What must we do then? Find him. Figure out what he's done. And then kill him. Listen. There's a woman here someplace. She has some messages we'll need. And I'm of no use to anyone right now. Could you find her? Enough time has been wasted. Oh, check around the inn. Ask if she's heard from the Orbe Monastery. Be careful out on the steps. Very nice. while I'm in town. Check our market. Maybe avoid seeing me again? <sighs> no, no word from Orbe. Same as yesterday and the day before. But I have something else. 
Roma has it a pale man passed through the Abaru Canyon some time ago. Fearsome fellow, dressed in black. After Lorath's performance last night, I wager he'll want to know. Strange. I wrote to the Orbay Monastery the day I arrived. The abbot should have replied by now. Tekrin spoke of a rumor. A pale man seen near the canyons. The canyons? Why didn't you say so? We go at once. Oh, but we can't leave Orbay unchecked. Sod it. I'm off to the canyons. You can meet me there or go to the monastery. You seem reliable. Thus far, do not prove me wrong. The scholars of Orbe devote their lives. I wrote to the abbot seeking insights. The man never misses a chance. <laughs> Is he insane, you mean? Elias was an exception. Whatever truth he has found in Lilith. I'd hoped to find a witness who saw Elias. Instead, I have a camp of dead merchants. They were slaughtered by demons, that much is plain. But none were summoned here. We should search the canyons. Could Elias have summoned these demons? Easily. And assuming he did, he may still be here. Stay close to me. I'm not ready yet. Hidden 
isolated. Perfect for working in solitude. Coming to a hell rip. I will close it. Put them down. Too easy. These demons were vermin. I'd expect more from a mage of Elias's ability. Let's search the house. Today, Master Elias called at my door. I had trouble with my words, so I showed him my carvings. He said he could see my pain in them. The pain of a lonely man who had learned to hate the world. And yet, our mother, Lilith, found me beautiful. He said there are others like me as well. And together, we will build the new world. What a damn mess. Burning hells! But too late. Elias is long gone. This Genba is our summoner. How can you be certain? Isn't it obvious? Elias finds Genba alone, friendless, full of anger. So he plays him like a fiddle, offers him Lilith's love and a part in his grand delusion. Then he gives him tools to express his anger. Summoning scrolls. Very perceptive. Who knows how long Genba has stewed in this madness. Let's hope he can still be questioned. Thank you. 
for sending Master Elias to show me the way. I long for the day when we stand by your side and set the cleansing fire. Visitors, D did Master Elias send you? Master Elias? Well, yes, in fact, he did. Ours is a very important mission. We have something for the Master, but we had heard he was with you. Do you know where he is? Liar! Dirty pig's born liar! The Master has all he needs! news first. Gemba was expecting someone. It seems Elias has turned others to his madness. Taught them to summon too, I'd wager. You heard Gemba. The master has all he needs. They're about to do something drastic. <sighs> and the good news? <laughs> Elias gave us a gift, remember? This demon he sent to kill us. It is unique. It requires constant feeding. Human sacrifices, in fact. If I cut open its belly, someone inside might hold a clue. Tell us where it came from. I must have it brought to Kedbardu for examination. Make yourself useful and head for the Orbe Monastery. See what's keeping that bloody abbot. The dry steps have no Cathedral of Light, no Druids and their capital city, Gulran, has been sacked. Many are vulnerable, just like Genbar. We must learn what Elias has planned for them. Elias had a talent for persuasion. Convenient trait for a Haradrim, given our dealings. But he could be... relentless when he wanted something. Even cruel. In that way, he and Lilith are similar. Suffering. Bloodshed. To them, these are a means to an end. They will bring out the worst in each other. 
Denarius' stupidity never ceases to amaze. Had he not murdered Rathma, Lilith might have been stopped. But now, now she has the key to hell. We can assume she'll be looking for a door. Oh, Donan. The poor fool never could have guessed that Lilith would come for Astaroth, let alone offer his boy to it. But what does she buy in return? Astaroth hails from the realm of hatred, same as she. Perhaps she left something at home. I must wait. Bandits.
ready yet. Someone like you on my crew? I don't run with benefits. Then
I must wait. Ready yet. Look out! I must wait. What is this? my life. Sure. <laughs> 